Take a moment, read the problem, and try it out on your own. Press play and we'll solve it together. It tells us to write this product as a single term with a rational exponent. So an exponent that's probably a fraction. As long as it's a rational number though, not an irrational number, you're fine. So how do we do this? The first thing I would do is rewrite this using fractional exponents. It's what they're asking for. The third root of x is x to the one-third. And in general, you can say x to the one over n is the nth root of x. So here, what root are we taking? It's the square root or second root. So it's x to the one-half. Then all you have to do is apply another law of exponents. If you're multiplying two things, let's say a, and they are, have equal bases, and you're multiplying, just add the exponents. It's a to the m plus n. So if you had two cubed times two to the fourth, you're literally multiplying seven twos, which is three plus four, or seven. So here, you're just gonna add. It's one-third, which is two-sixth, plus one-half, which is three-sixth, and that gets you x to the five-sixth. That's our answer right there. But if you had to go further, you could say that it equals the sixth root of x to the fifth power. And this fifth power could be inside or outside this symbol. It'll still be equivalent. But they want it with a rational exponent, which is this number right here. All right, I hope that helped.